continue with where we had left yesterday. So basically we are in the topic solution of state equation. Yes sir. Solution of state equation. And in this context we are solving an equation of this type in the beginning x dot equal to ax. Enough? Yes, sir. Well, x of p naught is defined as x. Enough? Yes, sir. It's a homogeneous state equation. Okay? No yes, input term. Yes. And we have already seen that the solution of this equation is of this form. x of p is equal to e to the power a p minus t naught into x naught. Yes, sir. Enough? Yes, sir. Now, if P naught is equal to 0, which can always be taken for LTA systems, yes. because it doesn't matter what is the initial time. So, x of P will be equal to e to the power a, a P x, x naught. Enough? Yes, sir. Okay? Yes, sir. This e to the power a P we have seen, it's mat matrix exponential. Yes, sir. Enough? Yes, sir. And it's actually through this matrix that the in any initial state is transitioned to some final state x t. Yes, That's why this matrix e to the power a t is known as, in, in control theory, it's known as state transition matrix. What do we call this? State transition matrix. State transition matrix. And sometimes it's also written as represented as phi of p. Yes, sir. Phi, phi of p is equal to e to the power 8. Yes, okay. Why we call it state transition matrix? Because you know x0 is the initial state. Yeah? Yes, sir. It is the state at time t. So you know? Yes, sir. So e to the power a p through this matrix the states make a transition from any initial state to some final state xp. That's why this is known as state transition right. matrix. Okay. And as I told you, phi p is equal to e to the power 80. This is how it is sometimes represented. Kal humne properties of state transition matrix likhi thi. Yes, sir. Agar hum unko is form mein likhe, phi t ke form mein, rewrite kare. Properties of state transition matrix. Pahli property kya likhi thi humne? E to the power A0 is equal to I. Hai na? Yes sir. So pahli property jo hai ji, that will be phi 0 is equal to I. Got it? Yes sir. Yeh me already proof kiya hai ka. Yes sir. Dusri property kya likhi thi? E power A T plus tau. Phi of t plus tau is equal to, is equal to phi of t phi into of phi of tau. Yes, sir. So, yeah. yes, sir. Third property kya likha tha? Inverse wala. Yes, sir. Phi of t inverse. Phi inverse of t is equal to phi of minus t. Yes, sir. So, yeah, na? Yes, sir. Then fourth property was related to the differentiation. Yes, sir. So, d by dt phi of t of phi of t phi of t is equal to what? Uh, a e power e phi of t a phi of t a phi of t or phi of phi t a yes sir enough yes sir I'll write one more property that is phi of t two minus t zero yes sir is equal to phi of t two minus t one into phi of t one minus t zero yes sir so we have T2 is less, um, sorry, where um, T2 is greater than T1, that's greater than T. Yes, sir. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. So, is the proof care Panchi Wali property? Ka? It's simple, eh? Proof of this property number fifth. Okay? Yes, sir. What is phi of T2 minus T0 equal to? That's e to the power A T2 minus T0. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. अब RHS लेंगे, ये LHS है ना, RHS क्या है, 
phi of phi of t two minus t one t one into phi of phi of t one minus t one minus t zero. See ya. Yes sir. That is e to the power a t two minus t one into e to the power a t one minus t zero. हमने देखा है प्रॉपर्टी नंबर टू से हम पावर्स को कंबाइन कर सकते हैं दैट्स ई टू द पावर ए टी टू माइनस ए टी वन प्लस ए टी वन दैट इज जीरो पावर्स को कंबाइन किया जा सकता है ना तो यहाँ पे क्या बचेगा फिर माइनस ए टी नो दैट इज ई टू द पावर ए टी टू माइनस टी नो विच इज एलिज है ना यस तो आर दिस इज एलिज सो दिस इज प्रॉपर्टी नंबर फाइव दिस एक्च that the state transition matrix from some time t0 to t2 if we have to evaluate the state transition matrix from some time t0 to t2, t2 it can always be broken down into a number of steps yes sir are you getting me yes sir so this is property number 5 these properties we have already stated yesterday yes, sir. but now we have restated them in term, them in terms of this phi t where phi t is not the state transition matrix it's one of the most important matrices in control theory yes sir Are you getting me? Yes, this matrix uh, results in the transition of states from its some initial state to final state. Yes, sir. So what? Yes, sir. Okay. अभी भी ये problem पूरी तरह से solve नहीं है क्योंकि हमें अभी पता नहीं है कि e to the power eighty को solve कैसे करेंगे. Yes, sir. जैसे मान लो मुझे कोई initial state दिया हुआ है और मुझे देखा और मुझे ये equation solve करनी है x dot equal to a x मुझे solve करनी है. तो मुझे पता है कि इसका solution है x t equal to e to the power eighty x not. X not तो मुझे दिया हुआ है. e to the power a t कैसे evaluate करूं क्योंकि a तो matrix है yes sir अगर ये scalar होता तो मैं use कर कर सकता था इसको solve तो मुझे सीखना है कि matrix exponential या state transition matrix को solve कैसे किया जाता है तो हमारा topic होगा for for maybe for today we'll take it up so this is what we have to actually solve this e to the power a t do you get me yes now before I take you to that let's first of all Have the complete solution of the state equation. That is solution of solution of non-homogeneous state equation. That means this way input term be ho. Now there solution of non-homogeneous state equation. अभी तक तो हमने होमोजेनियस स्टेट इक्वेशन सॉल्व की तो आई हैव द इक्वेशन ऑफ दिस टाइप x डॉट इक्वल टू ए एक्स प्लस बी यू टर्म भी है इसमें वेयर x ऑफ t नॉट इज डिफाइंड एज x ऑफ t समझ गए मुझे इक्वेशन सॉल्व करनी है इन द प्रेजेंस ऑफ इनपुट सो हाउ डू आई सॉल्व इट जस्ट लुक एट द स्टेप्स So this equation is to be solved. What do I do with this equation? X dot. I take this a x on this side. So this is x dot minus a x is equal to b u. So yeah. Yes, sir. Now I pre-multiply both sides by e to the power minus a t. Yes, sir. What do I get? I get e to the power minus, minus a t x dot minus. A minus a x है ना yes, is equal to e to the power minus a t b u सही है yes, now look at this d by d t of e to the power minus a t x yes sir what will this be equal to it will be equal to e yes. to the power minus a t रखेंगे yes. ऐसे ही ये yes, product of two terms है ना yes sir x का Differentiation, differentiation x dot yes sir plus x plus c. अब इसकी differentiation yes sir. तो minus minus a a e to the power minus a t x or x. तो yes that is e to the power minus a t x x dot minus a x a x. वो यही है ना yes sir. तो इसके बदले में लिख सकता हूँ ना d by d t of e to the power minus a t x. So instead of this, I can write down d by d t of e to the power minus a t x. X t is here, and I actually x t here. Yes, sir. X is a function of t. Yes, sir. That is equal to e to the power minus a t b u. So here. Yes, sir. Acha. U b t here actually. Yeah, b is a function of t. Yes, sir. 
you have to. Now integrating both sides. From 0 to t. A t is a final time. Mm. Okay. So once I integrated this d by dt goes. Yes sir. So I get e to the power minus a t x t integrated from 0 to t. Yes sir. Or you have say integral of 0 to t. So yeah. Yes sir. B bar. E to the power. Wait, wait. T to the power minus, minus a t. Because now since the we I am integrating from 0 t. to t. So I will change the variable here. Yes sir. I write it e to the power minus a tau b u tau b d tau. Yes, sir. Integrate kar na isko? Yes, sir. If I integrate kar raha hon from 0 to t, I have changed this change of variable I have used here. So, I will um, give the limits here. So, what will I get? e to the power minus a t x t yes, sir. minus e to the power minus a 0. x naught. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is equal to integral of 0 to t e to the power minus a tau b u tau d tau. So, yeah? Yes, sir. So, that means e to the power minus a t x t. Ye to 1 ho gaya? Yes, sir. Minus x naught is equal to integral of 0 to t e to the power minus a tau b u B I say, na? Yes, sir. B U tau B tau. So yeah. Yes, sir. Now this is e to the power minus a t x t. X zero I can take on this side. Yes, sir. So this is x zero plus integral of zero to t e to the power minus a tau B U tau and D tau. So yeah. Yes, sir. Okay. Now what do I do? I have to actually obtain x t. Why? You know solution is coming. Yes, sir. I'll pre-multiply both sides by e to the power a t. Pre-multiply both sides by e to the power a t. What do I get? e to the power a t into e to the power minus a t. Yes, that is i. I. Yes, sir. So I get x t equal to x e to the power a t x naught plus plus integral of zero to t yes, sir. E, e to the power a t minus tau t minus tau. Yes, sir. B u tau. B u tau and d tau. So yeah. Yes. Sir. Yes. Sir. इसको मैंने इंटेग्रेट किया फ्रॉम 0 टू t yes, अगर मेरा इनिशियल टाइम कोई t नॉट होता हैड इट बीन समथिंग लाइक t नॉट तो आई वुड हैव टू इंटीग्रेट फ्रॉम t नॉट टू t t नॉट टू t यस सर तो उस केस में इफ द इनिशियल टाइम इज इफ द इनिशियल टाइम इज t नॉट तो ये इक्वेशन क्या बनेगी x ऑफ t इक्वल टू e टू द पावर a t minus t नॉट x naught plus integral of t naught to t e to the power a t minus tau b u tau d tau. Yes. Because initial time, linear time unit systems, man, for the sake of convenience, always zero is taken. Yes, so this equation suffices. Yes, sir. But then this is the general equation. If yes, the initial time is some other time t naught. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. I get it. <coughs> Very much, understand? Yes, sir. So, this solution is equation. This is solution non-homogeneous state equation. Yes, sir. So, you can see that the solution has two parts. Yes, sir. One is this one, and the other is this one. Yes, sir. This one is the one that we have in homogeneous state equation. E to the yes, power at x naught. Yes, sir. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. And this one is extra. Hai. Yes, sir. This one is u hai. input wali term, which in previous case was 0. Thi. Yes, sir. Are you oh, getting me? Yes, sir. So if u is 0, this term becomes 0, so you get only this thing. Yes, sir. Are you getting me? So in this solution, there are two parts. One is this one part, which is not dependent on the input. Which is dependent on the initial conditions or system. Pe. System, yes, sir. Initial this is known as the natural response. This one is this. What is this known as? Natural response. And this part of the uh, response is due to the input u. Yes, sir. This part of the response is known as the forced response. What do we call it? Forced response. 
Do you remember when, see, when you solve differential equations in mathematics, जब आपको सिखाते हैं differential equation solve करना, तो उसमें उसमें भी solution के दो हिस्से आते हैं. एक तो transient component आता है solution का, that is made that is primarily due to the system itself. And then there is the जिसमें वो particular integral करते हैं ना evaluation. ये वही है basically. This is exactly what what it is. Only difference is that it's a matrix differential equation, but it's exactly the solution has the same format. You can see that this is the natural response of the system. That means the response in the absence of inputs. It will depend merely upon the system. E पे depend करेगा. और इस वाले में ये जो बाकी portion है response का, first response जिसको कहते हैं, ये E पे भी depend करता है, B पे भी depend करता है, U पे भी depend करता है. Are you getting me? This is the force. This is due to the external input that's being applied to the system. So this is what is the solution of a non-homogeneous state equation. तो अगर आपको state equation दी हुई है और आपको कहा जा रहा है कि इनपुट मान लो स्टेप इनपुट है और आपको ये क्वेश्चन सॉल्व आपको वो स्टेट इक्वेशन सॉल्व करनी है तो इसका सलूशन ये है इसके इसको सॉल्व करने में बस एक ही रुकावट है वो है ई टू द पॉवर ए टी या ई टू द पॉवर ए टी माइनस ट्राउ एक ही बात है तो आई हैव टू लर्न हाउ टू इवेलुएट ई टू द पॉवर ए टी गेट मी आई हैव टू लर्न हाउ टू इवेलुएट स्टेट ट्रांजेक्शन मैट्रिक तो फिलहाल आप ये याद रखोगे कि अगर आपको कोई स्टेट इक्वेशन दी हुई है जिसमें कि इनिशियल कंडीशंस नॉन जीरो है और इनपुट यू है और आपको उसको सॉल्व करना और इफ व्हाट एवर इनिशियल कंडीशंस यू है दिस इज द वे यू हैव टू सॉल्व इट दिस इज द सॉल्यूशन एक्स टी को टी टू द पावर ए टी एक्स नॉट प्लस इंटीग्रल ऑफ जीरो टू टी ई टू द पावर ए टी माइनस टाउ बी यू टाउ बी टाउ इसमें एक टर्म जो है पहली वाली टर्म इसको नेचुरल रिस्पॉन्स कहते हैं इसको ट्रांजेंट रिस्पॉन्स भी कहते हैं this is also known as transient, transient response and this portion of the response which is the second term here this is known as the forced response because this is due to the external input external forcing function yes, that is being applied to the system is that clear? yes sir so having obtained the solution of the non-homogeneous state equation now we will get back to the evaluation of state transition matrix how to actually evaluate the I will show you at least three methods of evaluating the state transition matrix yes. Evaluation of state transition matrix. That's we have to learn. If I write this equation, I write in terms of phi, which is previous one, the solution of thing, yeah, na. In terms of phi t, how will we write it? x t equal to phi t x naught plus integral of 0 to t phi of t minus star b u tau and do beta. So, if it is initial time t naught, what will happen in that case? It will be phi of t minus t naught x of t naught है ना plus integral of t naught to t phi of t minus star v u tau v tau d tau हो जाए yes sir it's in terms of because in many books you will find the equation written in this form yes sir are you getting it अच्छा let me get back to this so I have to evaluate the state transition matrix I have to learn how to evaluate e to the power a t are you getting me? Yes, sir. मैं आपको इसके तीन तरीके दिखाऊंगा state transition matrix को evaluate करने के. Then it's up to you which one you want to use, which one is convenient. First method is using, I'll show you three methods of evaluating it. One is using Laplace transform method. Okay. Yes, sir. Using Laplace transform method. दूसरा method मैं आपको दिखाऊंगा इसको evaluate करने का using Similarity transformation. Okay. Yes, sir. And third method, I will show you of evaluating state transition matrix that's using Kelly Hamilton theorem. I think you must have read it in matrix theory. Kelly Hamilton theorem. 
ये तीन मेथड्स में आपको स्टेट ट्रांजिशन मैट्रिक्स इवेलुएट करने के लिए काम करते हैं ठीक है तो पहले पहला वाला मेथड देखेंगे दैट इज यूजिंग लैपलेस ट्रांसफॉर्मर लेट्स सी दिस मेथड फर्स्ट वी हैव एन इक्वेशन लाइक दिस x डॉट इक्वल टू ax है ना यस सर हमने देखा है कि इसका सॉल्यूशन जो हमने देखा इसमें जो x ऑफ t नॉट है that is defined as x नॉट है ना यस सर and if x of t not if t not is zero again same okay what is the solution of this equation we have seen that this equation has the solution t to the power a t x not yes sir ye humne iska solution dekh liya ye hum rakhenge dhyan mein theek hai yes sir we will take the laplace transform of this equation on both sides taking laplace so laplace transform would like it S X of S X of S minus X zero yes is equal to A X of S A X of S yes so yeah yes sir or I can write S I minus A X of S is equal to X zero so yeah or I can write X of S is equal to S I minus A inverse X one. Okay. X of S is equal to S I minus A inverse X one. Okay. Taking inverse Laplace. What do I get? X inverse Laplace. This X T. X T yes. And it is equal to Laplace inverse of. S I minus A inverse into X one. Yes, sir. Huh? Sure. Now compare it with this. Compare one and two. What do you get here? X T यहाँ पे भी है, X T यहाँ पे भी है. X not यहाँ पे भी है, X not यहाँ पे भी है. Yes, sir. E to the power A T की जगह ही है. Yes. So what is e to the power a t equal to then? Laplace inverse of s. Laplace inverse of s i minus a. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. So Laplace inverse of this matrix s i minus a inverse. Yes, sir. This is sometimes represented as phi of s. Phi of s. So we have phi of s. Phi of s is equal to s i minus a inverse, and this is in matrix theory known as a resolvent matrix of a. What is this known as matrix theory as? A resolvent matrix of a. So what do you have to do? How do you obtain e to the power a t? You first of all obtain s i minus a. Yes, ये तो पता होगा आपको yes, then you obtain s i minus a inverse yes, उसका inverse yes, फिर उसका yes, laplace inverse फिर उसका laplace inverse so हर एक टर्म को matrix yes, बनेगा ना yes, वो आपका e to the power a t e to the power a t yes sir समझे yes sir so it is an easy way of evaluating state transition matrix particularly if the size of a is small yes sir अगर मान लो a two cross two है उस केस में easily solve होता है लेकिन जितना इतना साइज मैट्रिक्स का बढ़ता है उतना इसको मैन्युअली इवैल्यूएट करना डिफिकल्ट बट देन दिस इज वन ऑफ द मेथड्स दैट कैन बी यूज्ड टू सॉल्व फॉर टू इवैल्यूएट द स्टेट ट्रांजिशन इज दैट क्लियर यस सर सो दिस इज मेथड नंबर 1 नाउ मेथड नंबर 2 मेथड नंबर 2 इज यूजिंग Similarity transforms. मैंने e to the power a t evaluate करना है। हाँ सर। है ना? जी सर। अगर कोई matrix diagonal form में हो मान लो, मान लो ये है matrix let's say lambda. It's in diagonal form, like this, lambda one, 
lambda 2, so on, up to lambda n. There are all zeros here as well as here. It's a diagonal wedge. Yes, sir. This is Baki Sari entry zero and Kali diagonal wali entry is non zero. You cannot? Yes, sir. Asymmetric ka exponential obtain karna easy ho ta hai. Agar mujhe iska matrix exponential obtain karna ho e to the power lambda t, that'll be simple. I'll have to evaluate like this e to the power lambda 1 t, e to the power lambda 2 t, so on, e to the power lambda n t. So, yeah. Yes, sir. For Baki Sari is zero. There's a diagonal matrix ka inverse obtain karna bhi easy hota hai. You have to take the reciprocal of the individual entry. Yes, sir. Similarly, if you have to obtain the matrix exponential for a diagonal matrix, very easy. You take the exponential of the individual term. Yes, sir. And you can obtain this. Are you getting me? Yes, sir. But then, okay. But your matrix A may not be always in diagonal form. It may be in any other form. Yes, so what do we do? We first of all transform the given system of equations to diagonal form. Yes, A ko pehle hum diagonalize karte hain. Yes sir. Fir uska matrix exponential obtain karte hain. Yes, Aur finally usse hum original matrix ka exponential obtain karte hain. How do we do that? I will show you. If we have a matrix A, if we have a matrix A, which has a real and distinct eigenvalues lambda 1, lambda 2, so on up to lambda n. We have already proved that there exists a similarity transformation matrix P and which transforms matrix A into diagonal form. Last one lecture only proved here. Yes, sir. If you have a matrix A, this can eigenvalues real or distinct. Yes, sir. So, if you have a similarity transformation matrix P exists, which transforms A into diagonal form matrix lambda. Yes, sir. Such that lambda is equal to P inverse of. If we where lambda is such that we can get where lambda is equal to P inverse of AP. AP. P matrix is my care matrix of that. The last time they got that. Diagonalize can be P matrix. Kya on a day? Is here a care eigenvectors of no other thing. Yes, sir. Where P has the eigenvectors of A. Eigen vectors of A stacked as column, stacked as column, and lambda has the eigenvalues as diagonal entry, diagonal entry. Yes, sir. So, yeah. Now, what would be e to the power lambda t by definition of state transition matrix? By definition of matrix exponential, it is equal I to i a i plus a lambda a t, and a a t plus lambda t as a t. Say so a lambda square t square upon two factorial plus so on. Plus so on, yes sir. And a yes sir. So e to the power lambda t is equal to i. What is lambda equal to? P inverse of AP. Yes, sir. P inverse of AP. So, yeah. Yes, then you have T. Yes, then you have lambda square T square. That is P inverse of AP. Square, right? Yes, sir. So, two times. P inverse of AP. So, yeah. 
सही है yes, टी स्क्वायर अपॉन टू फैक्टर प्लस हो मैं सही लिख रहा हूं yes, so, e to the power lambda t is equal to, i की जगह आई कैन राइट पी इन वर्स ऑफ पी प्लस पी इनवर्स ऑफ ए पी टी सही है yes, यहाँ पे पी पी इनवर्स है ये आई हुआ ना यस आई है पी इनवर्स ऑफ ए स्क्वायर देन पी देन टी स्क्वायर अपॉन टू फैक्टोरियल प्लस वन एम राइटिंग इट करेक्ट यस सही है यस सो ई टू द पावर लेमना टी इज इक्वल टू इफ आई टेक दिस पी इनवर्स कॉमन ऑन दिस साइड and p common on this side what will i get here i'll get i here yes sir plus p was bahar nikala yahan pe a rahega p wahan se bahar nikala hai aur t rahega kyunki t scalar hai ji sir plus p was yahan se bahar nikala hai aur p yahan se bahar nikala hai what do we get inside a square t square upon 2 factorial plus 1 ji sir so that is e to the power lambda t is equal to p inverse of what is this e to the power at at and then p yes sir sahi hai yes sir mujhe actually evaluate karna hai e to the power at yes sir so i'll pre multiply both sides by p what will i get p e to the power lambda t the pre multiply p se karenge ये आई बनेगा yes, so it's e to the power ATP. ATP, yes, इस पी को खत्म करने के लिए पोस्ट मल्टीप्लाई बोथ साइड्स पे पी इनवर्स व्हाट आई गेट आई गेट पी ई टू द पावर लैमडा टी पी इनवर्स ये पावर ए टी इज इक्वल टू ई टू द पावर ए टी समझ आया तो अगर आपको e to the power ए टी वैल्युएट करना है ए पर रेस्ट्रिक्शन ये है कि उसके रियल और डिस्टिंग आइगन वैल्यूज है तो आप पहले पी ऑप्टेन करो वो पी जो कि इस ए को डायगोनाइज करेगा दैट मीन्स आप ए के आइगन वैक्टर्स ऑप्टेन करो और उनको एक मैट्रिक्स पी में डाल दो एज कॉलम्स तो आपका मैट्रिक्स पी बन जाएगा वो हमने ऑलरेडी प्रूव किया है कि वो ए को डायगोनाइज करता है और ए के आइगन वैल्यूज भी ऑप्टेन करो क्योंकि लेमडा ये वाला मैट्रिक्स जो है इसके कॉलम्स में वही आइगन वैल्यूज ही होते हैं yes, तो अगर आपको आइगन वैल्यूज पता है तो आप ई टू दॉलमेट कर सकते हो जो मैंने अभी बताया आपको कि यू हैव टू टेक द एक्सपोनेंशियल ऑफ द इंडिविजुअल एंट्रीज ऑन द डायगन और पी भी आपने ऑप्टेन किया है पीनोस पीनोस भी ऑप्टेन किया जा सकता है फ्रॉम दैट यू कैन ऑप्टेन ई टू दिस इज अनदर मैथड ऑफ इवेलुएटिंग द स्टेट ट्रांजेशन मैथडिंग सो फॉर बट द रेस्ट्रिक्शन ऑन ए इज दैट इट मस्ट हैव रियल एंड डिस्टिंग तभी आप इस मेथड को यूज कर सकते हो तो पहले आपको देखना पड़ेगा कि क्या गिवन मैट्रिक्स के आइगन वैल्यूज रियल और डिस्टिंक्ट हैं yes, अगर उसके आइगन वैल्यूज रियल और डिस्टिंक्ट हैं तो आप इस मेथड को यूज करके इसको ऑप्टेन कर सकते हो सो दिस मेथड ऑफ इवेलुएटिंग स्टेट ट्रांसलेशन मैथड सो Before I uh, move to method number three, let's first of all solve one numerical. You can write down. Consider the system. Not equal to zero zero minus two zero one zero and one zero and three into x. And x not is given. X zero is given as these are the initial conditions. Zero one and three. 
ये x डॉट इक्वल टू एक स्टाइल की इक्वेशन है ये मैंने सॉल्व कर ली ओके विल सॉल्व दिस इक्वेशन यूजिंग फर्स्ट मेथड लैपस ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन इसमें a का वैल्यू जो है दैट इज जीरो जीरो माइनस टू जीरो वन एंड जीरो वन जीरो We use the Laplace transform method of solving. Yes, Laplace transform method apply करने के लिए मुझे क्या करना पड़ेगा? I have to first of all obtain S I minus A. तो S I minus A हम लिखेंगे पहले. What is S? S is S zero 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 S zero 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 and S. Okay? Yes. Minus what is A? Zero 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 and minus two zero one and zero one zero and zero. सही है? Yes. That's for the equal to that's s zero and two zero s minus one zero s minus one one and zero s minus three and you have got minus one zero minus one zero s minus three. अब मुझे इसका inverse चाहिए. क्योंकि मुझे obtain क्या करना है e to the power eight which is actually equal to lap plus inverse of अगर मुझे एस आई माइनस ए इनवर्स ऑप्टेन करना है That's why I told in the beginning that you have to revise matrix theory. Sorry, yes, sir. Anna? Yes, sir. Hello, okay. Minus one plus s minus Yes, 
Sido. Yeah. Yes, sir. So we are there. Yeah, yes, sir. S minus 1, S minus 3, 0, 2 S minus 2. Sir, we sir. 2 S plus 2 I guess. Minus 2 S plus 2. Yeah, join. Yes, sir. Inverse 3 into this this is divided by the next one. Yes, sir. S carry. So, what is it? It is not We will have to divide it by this. How do you divide it by this? Yes, sir. S minus 1, 8 cancel. S minus 3 divided by S minus 2. S minus 3. S minus 1, S minus 2. S minus 3. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So you will have SI minus A inverse equal to what? Yeah. You'll have S minus 3 upon S minus 1 into S minus 2. Pali term, right? Yes, sir. Those term 0. This term can be minus 2 upon S minus 1. S minus 1. Yes, into S minus 2. Say yes? Yes, sir. Say S minus 2 cancel over. Come on, we have to cancel over. S minus 1 cancel. S minus 1, yes, sir. S minus 1 cancel. Yes, sir. You have to 0 aiga? 0. You have to S minus 1, S minus 2 cancel over aiga? And what will remain here? 1 divided by S minus 1. 1 divided by S minus 1. Say yes? Yes, sir. So you have to 0. You have to 8 S minus 1 cancel over here. What remains is 1 upon s minus 1 into s minus 2. So, yeah. Yes, then 0. And you have to get like s upon s minus 1 into s minus 2. Do you get it? Yes, sir. Here is si minus a inverse. Yes, sir. Would you e to the power 80 obtain karna hai? Jho la plus inverse hai. Yes, sir. So, obviously, is even la plus. E to the power 80 will be la plus inverse of S I minus A inverse. So, how do term call that plus inverse? Yes, sir. Right? Yes, sir. So, we have to take the Laplace inverse of every term. Pahli term, they say, S minus 3 upon S minus 1 into S minus 2. Yes, sir. Is the Laplace inverse of the term? Sir, we will evaluate it. Then, 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 we will separate it. Then, we will evaluate it. Then, we will evaluate it. S minus 3 upon S minus 1 into S minus 2 का partial fraction expansion करो A upon S minus 1 plus B upon S minus 2 है ना Then give me the two terms in this ये तब तक पॉज करना नहीं करो करो डू
So you have to basically take the partial fraction expansion of s minus 3 upon s minus 1 into s minus 2. Har ek term ka aise hi. That will be a upon s minus 1 plus b upon s minus 2. Yes sir. That s minus 3 is equal to a into s minus 2 plus b into s minus 1. Yes sir. We can compare the coefficients of s on both sides. Yes sir. So I will have 1 equal to a plus b. Yes, we can compare the coefficients, uh, constants on both sides. Yes, Second sir. equation will be minus 3 is equal to minus, minus two, 2 a minus 2a minus b. Minus b. Ye do equations yes, uh, simultaneously. Yes, sir. A is equation ko add kar sakta hon. Yes, sir. Yore cut ho So this will be minus 2 is equal to minus a. Minus so a will be 2. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And b will be uh, minus 2 one. minus 1. 1 minus 2. Mm. That's minus 1. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So this I can write as s minus 3 upon s minus 1 into s minus 2. I can write it as 2 upon s minus 1. So yeah? Yes, sir. Minus 1 upon s minus 2. So once I take its Laplace in, in, inverse, what will I get? Parity term, man. I'll get 2 e to the power t. Yes, sir. Minus 1, oh. minus 1 e to the power 2t. Yes, sir. So, yeah. Yes, sir. Those two terms are 0. Hai. Those two terms. This is the third term. Ka bhi batao kya hai same method. Se karke. Same method. Same partial fraction expression. Karne na? So, equation to same. So, you have equations. So, this method is going to solve separately. What we are getting is, I'll write it here. I'm getting e to the power a t as. I'm getting it as 2 e to the power t minus e to the power 2 t. So here, we have obtained here, 0. Then, 2 e to the power t minus 2 e to the power 2t then 0 so we have to simply is kind of level of inverse e to the power t yes, sir. then 0 is for the term kajara that's minus e to the power t plus e to the power 2t okay yes, then this is 0 then this is coming out to be 2 e to the power 2t minus e to the power t like this yes sir this is your state transition matrix. Okay? Yes, sir. State transition matrix. See, if I have to solve the uh, solution, what is this equation? Ka? Actually, the equation is equal to x dot equal to x. Yes, sir. So, the solution you know that is equal to xt solution is xt is equal to e to the power at x naught. Yes, e to the power at. Yeah. That's 2 e to the power t minus e to the power 2 t. 0, 2 e to the power t minus 2 e to the power 2 t, yes, then 0, e to the power t and 0, then minus e to the power t plus e to the power 2 t, then 0, 2 e to the power 2 t minus e to the power t. For x naught, what was the question? Mein? x naught. 0, 1. x naught was 0, 1, 1. 0, 1? 1. 1. 1. Yes, sir. 1. 1. 1. 1. 1. 0, 1, 1, yes sir. Anyway, whatever. Do be initial conditions on. Yes sir. Huh? So, this is matrix product. Say, you have to do it. And the answer then? This is 0. 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 This is 2 e to the power t minus 2 e to the power 2 t. 2 t. And then? Yes. This is e to the power t. E to the power t, yes sir. Yeah, pair last term. Yes sir. 2 e to the power 2 t minus e to the power t. Yes sir. Yes sir. So this is how we solve it. Yes sir. So this means that mathematics is very involved. Yes sir. So you have to do it in a number of steps. Yes sir. Isn't it? The second method that we have learned that can be used for evaluating the state transition matrix in case where the poles are or the eigenvalues are real and distinct. Yes. But in this case, you can see that we have determinant of SI minus A. Yes, sir. 
डिटरमिनेंट ऑफ एसआई माइनस ए ही बेसिकली है ना करेक्टरिस्टिक इक्वेशन वो क्या आया डिटरमिनेंट ऑफ एसआई माइनस ए डिटरमिनेंट ऑफ एसआई माइनस ए से वो आया था हमें एस माइनस वन एस माइनस वन सुकैर एस माइनस टू एस माइनस वन दैट मीन्स इसके जो पोल्स हैं दैट्स वन वन एंड टू रिपीटेड पोल्स हैं तो वो वाला मेथड इसमें यूज़ नहीं किया जा सकता वी कैन नॉट यूज़ दैट मेथड हियर वी हैव टू यूज़ सॉल्व यूजिंग दिस मेथड और द थर्ड मेथड दैट वी स्टडी इन द नेक्स्ट स should revise that Kelly Hamilton theorem. You must have already read it in this. Yes, uh, there's a very simple matrix. statement of Kelly Hamilton theorem that every square matrix satisfies its own characteristic equation. Yes, sir. So that's the statement of Kelly Hamilton theorem. That theorem we'll be using in order to evaluate the state transition matrix in the next lecture. Yes. Are you getting me? Yes. Stop it.